What's going on guys? It's me Nee here bringing you guys another Madden 17 video and today guys I'm going to be showing you the start of one of my pretty big connected franchises. I don't run this personally but it's definitely my favorite league I'm in. It's the MCFL and currently I think we have 29 users. So basically what this league is, it's a league that Every season there will be, or every Madden, there will be four seasons, and they basically advance twice a week. It's a pretty fun league. I'm usually the Jaguars, but we decided to do a fifth season, and that's what I'm going to be recording and showing you guys today. It's just the fifth season. I'm the Chiefs for this, because the guy that's the Chiefs usually wanted to be the Ravens. There was a lot going on. Some people just didn't want to play the fifth season. We got a lot of users that want to play the fifth season, so we went ahead and did it and got some other users to fill in, mostly from my league. But this is the Chiefs team I'm working with this in this league. I'm currently 2-1. and one. I've had bad luck and somehow ended up with two CPU, two CPU games when all of the CPU teams, there's only like three of them now, so I somehow ended up with that. But I do... I did play, the only user I played against I lost to, but it's not like, I didn't lose to anyone bad. Merck's the commissioner, and he's probably, he makes the playoffs every season. So it's a pretty fun league. I'm going to be like posting highlights from the games I play, like little, quick, going over the important plays, what happened on a week-to-week -week basis. I decided to start this this week, so I'll start it with week four. The league does advance tomorrow, it advances every Wednesday and Sunday. But this is the Chiefs team I'm working with currently. With the rookie rosters, we got Patrick Mahomes, and I did some trading. Tyreek Hill is injured. First user I play against, he breaks his arm. He's out for six weeks currently. It's okay though, because I still got a lot of weapons with Jeremy Macklin and Chris Conley. Obviously, Travis Kelsey's been a great weapon. I've been thrown to him a lot. Uh, the offensive line has been good enough. There was a free agent draft to start the season. That's how I got Nick Mangold. He's got good strength and impact blocking, so decided it was good to scoop him up. I did trade Alex Smith to the Patriots, or not Patriots, the Bears, for Jeremy Langford and Eddie Goldman. Goldman is pretty good and he's going to be our starting defensive tackle and I'm trying out Langford at running back. He's played in two games with me so far and he has not done well. Probably because my offensive line has no run block. But who who knows if that's it or not. And obviously the Chiefs have a pretty good defense. We got Eric Berry as our captain, our free safety. We got Justin Houston who's obviously one of the best pass rushing linebackers in the league along with Marcus Peters, a really good corner, Derek Johnson, really solid middle linebacker, and a bunch of key players that that have done great so far in the season, just playing their role. A decent job, 2-1, and one, currently on top of the AFC West. Let you know what happens in the future. Who kn I, I think I'm going to play... I play the Steelers next week, which is an actual, actual user, so I'll have highlights from that. But this is my stats on the season so far. Not great. Eight touchdowns, five picks for Mahomes. He's a rookie. We're learning, getting through it. But this is really bad. Our rushing, no run game. 33 carries for 65 yards for Langford. Two yards a carry. Spencer Ware, 3.3 yards a carry. Pretty sure that was all CPU for Spencer Ware. But Langford has had a terrible time. Passing game has been much better. Kelsey, 289 yards, five touchdowns. I He's my red zone weapon, so I make sure to target him a lot there. Conley with 235, two touchdowns. Macklin having okay. Tyreek Hill would obviously have much better stats if he didn't get injured. And then I got decent stats. Three and a half sacks for Chris Jones, the rookie from Mississippi State. Houston only with one and a half sacks. Our leader in interceptions is Philip Gaines, two picks for 62 yards. He actually had a really cool highlight in that loss I had to the Texans where I only scored 10 points. I might include that in the next video just because I thought it was pretty good. 
Peters one interception, D Ford has one interception. That's basically the rundown of what's going on with my team in this league at this point. But I'm going to make sure to update you guys on what's going on. And I hope you enjoy this little video just introducing you to the league and everything. So if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe for future Madden CFM videos.